Hello people. Today I'm going to show you how to create an old Polaroid. Okay. So first we have to uh, create a new Photoshop document. Go file and new. I will use 320 pixels and 300 pixels. Click OK. So now um select rectangle tool change your background color good to white or foreground color to white and create something like that okay now And um, now, uh, take your uh, picture, go file, open, select your big picture. Now, I will hold down Control and press A to select my picture. Then hold down Control and press C to copy. Then I will go to my my big picture uh, document, this Polaroid document, and then go press I mean hold down Control and press V. Okay. Now we have our picture, but it is too big. So uh, hold down Control and press T to select advanced form tool now hold down shift on your keyboard it's like it's a button under caps lock and hold it down and drag it from one end to the size you like now okay it's it suits here so if you're uh, Size resizing is done. Press enter to apply. Okay, we have this. It like like this at the moment. This picture doesn't look very old, so let's duplicate our document. Right click on your uh, picture layer and select duplicate layer and click OK. Now go image adjustments black and white okay we have this now um, select tint make a little tick into this box okay now please now press ok go here and select torquen now now select your layer 1 two clicks on your layer and go stroke size 1 color something like that and press ok and uh, again ok now go to your layer 2 and double click on it go stroke size 1 and color like this and press ok now we have this now select your text tool and write write your whatever you want onto it now um, make sure your text color is black black and select 
um, a font that looks like handwritten. Um, something like that. And put this text to center of your Polaroid. And you have it. It was that simple. Now you can just add your background. And your picture looks like some like looks like this. It was that simple. So I hope you like this tutorial and it helped you and if you have questions feel free to um, post them. So more tutorials are coming soon. Okay, see ya.